Nobi Nobi Boy is an experimental game from the guy that created Katamari Damacy. You don't actually really have any sort of goal, you just kind of go around the level, you can stretch out your body, you control your head with one analog stick, your butt with the other, and you just eat things and wrap stuff around and just basically play with the world, there's not really any sort of set goal. The controls are too complicated in that L2 makes you jump and eat and hunker down your face, and so you'll kind of do the wrong thing when you try to do something else. The camera controls actually let you do a lot of stuff, but it's hard to use them at the same time that you're controlling your character because you have to hold two buttons and the angle of the controller and doing two things at the same time is a little awkward. The coolest part about the game is Girl, so when you play the game and you stretch out your, your character called Boy, you can then upload the length that you stretch to Girl, and she basically is the same thing you are except that she's stretching through space. And she takes the total amount of stretchingness that people have done in a level, and it continues to add. So when I reviewed the game, she was at 400 million meters, which means that she had actually gotten to the moon. And now she's on her way to Mars, and that's, I don't know how many hundred millions of meters, but as the community plays the game and continues to grow her, we will unlock new levels altogether, and that concept is really cool. So the game as a whole can be kind of cool if you want to play something as an experiment, and some of the concepts of using girl to unlock levels is really cool, but there's not really anything to do when you jump into the game. You just kind of go around, knock stuff over. You know, the rope physics on your body is awesome, but, you know, aside from that, there's not really any sort of goal, so, you know, while there's cool stuff to see, you'll probably get easily bored by it. For the full written review, head over to IGN.com.